Today I will bring you three verses about a living hope that is revealed to us, starting with 1 Peter 1, 3 through 6. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. According to his great mercy, he has caused us to be born again to a living hope through the resurrection of Jesus Christ from the dead, to an inheritance that is imperishable, undefiled, and unfading, kept in heaven for you, who by God's power you are being guarded through faith for a salvation ready to be revealed in the last time. In this you rejoice, though now for a little while, if necessary, you have been grieved by various trials, so that the tested genuineness of your faith, more precious than gold that perishes though it is tested by fire, may be found to result in praise, glory, and honor at the revelation of Jesus Christ. 2 Corinthians 4, 16, 18 So we do not lose heart, though our outer self is wasting away. Our inner self is being renewed day by day. For this light, momentary affliction is preparing us for an eternal weight of glory beyond all comparison. As we look not to the things that are seen, but to the things that are unseen. For the things that are seen are transient, but the things that are unseen are eternal. John 4, 13-14 Jesus said to her, Anyone who drinks of this water will be thirsty again. But whoever drinks of the water that I give him will never be thirsty again. Jesus, in speaking to the Samaritan woman here, reassures even her of the promises that come from having faith in him. Stand firm in your faith and praise God for your salvation and know that our suffering allows us to share in the suffering of Jesus Christ. Cling to your hope in the things that are unseen until we are together again. God bless you and amen.